I had a great opportunity this morning to talk to a bunch of the NFL Network announcers, a lot of Hall of Famers in that room, also Willie McGinnis. And one of the things I wanted to get their thoughts on was just how good the Patriots are consistently. And I love how this soundbite you're about to hear kind of builds one upon the other. It starts with Willie McGinnis. He gave his thoughts on how he looks at this current crop of Patriots players. What's funny to me is when I watch the Patriots struggle and I go back and I watch tape and I break things down, it's not a talent thing. It's never a talent thing. It's always a technique or mental errors or certain things that we harp on that's on the wall when you walk inside the building. Eliminate bad football and all those things are under their back. You know, penalties, mental errors, all those things that you see the reasons why they lose. They weren't the same team during the season. You know, they didn't play as well and they were trying to figure things out throughout the season and you know part of that was you know the changes that happened and you know bouncing back from a long year and and less off season and and all of those things but to their credit what they always do is they're able to identify the things that they need to get better at. Jimmy used to always do things that I love Jimmy would do. Jimmy the next year after we won the Super Bowl he would bring everybody in the room and he'll say everybody who has a ring stand up sit down. Everybody who doesn't have a ring stand up and he says everybody that does look around. I know you're happy with what you have, but they don't have anything. How about that? Michael Irvin really setting it out there. And you experienced that when you played, and a lot of guys on this team, Matt, are experiencing that now. Basically, you get to, uh, you get to experience sort of a new, a new experience. I, I'm using the word a lot there. But basically, in a locker room, every we, year we know this. It's, yeah, yes, there's going to be half the group that may have a ring or half the group that may have, have, have gone down that road before. But you look around the room, the Trent Browns, the Lawrence guys. There's guys like this in the room that have gotten close but don't have the ring. Or this is maybe the first experience of, of their life to do it. So the sticker travels. But this is something new that a lot of guys have a very strong appetite for. It's not just Tom Brady. Let me ask you this question. What's the most intriguing thing about the matchup for this game Sunday? The uncertainty with the offense from the Patriots. They can do it so many different ways, and it's so difficult as a defense if you're going to sit down and, and game plan. There's the Bills game. There's the Jets game. There's the there's the Chargers game. Really, week to week, they do things so differently, it really stresses you. You're not going to know what game plan they're in until you may be to halftime. 